Well, hello there, Epic Gamer Bit subscribers. We're here with Beastly Bunny doing a commentary over his gameplay. Introduce yourself, Beastly Bunny. Hello. There he is, and we also got Rambo and good friend, important friend, Swagger. Introduce yourselves, guys. Hello. Hey, guys, what's up? It's Rambo. You've heard my voice. Just Swagger's yes, but Swagger's a funny ass guy, so you'll enjoy hearing him. Yeah, Swagger is a very hilarious individual. And uh, so, Beastly, tell me about yourself and your gameplay here. <laughs> Fill us in. What are you using here? I'm um, using the uh, AK-47 Dual Mech. Oh, very nice. And I see you're using the emblem from uh, Modern Warfare 2, the Chopper Gunner? Yes. You know, I got a good story yeah. about the Chopper Gunner. Oh, God. Oh, I would like to would hear this. Would you like to hear this story, Scar? So, we played with Beastly, yes, I would. Played with Beastly Bunny before. And back in uh, <laughs> back in Modern Warfare 2, I think his name was Insurrect, and he was kind of a little annoying. But, you know, Beastly Bunny, now mm -hmm. he's cute and fluffy and, you know, whatever. Um, but I got a chopper gunner, you know? And this box means chopper gunner. It, I, I raged on him, but, you know, Beastly, it, it's time we bury the hatchet, so I'm going to extend a hand out, and, you know, I'm sorry for, you know, raging on you. <laughs> Thank you. If I may, um, yeah, see, you were on your second chopper gun, or like the first time you've ever gotten two choppers, and like Beastly boxed you in on the ladder, and uh, Beastly Bunny was scared of you for probably, I don't know, probably until maybe Black Ops came out. Yeah, I know, it was. And probably still a little bit to this day. I, I don't know. What do you think, Beastly? He's basically in control. Here's, here's an interesting side <laughs> note. I want everybody to notice how Rambo apologized to Beastly. Um,. Rambo could probably fill Madison Square Garden with the people that he should apologize to. For <laughs> you know who I'm never going to... Swagger, you know who I'm never going to apologize to in this uh, game for raging on? Uh, would that be me? Yeah, that would definitely be you. <laughs> you hey, want me to know yeah. another thing? Uh, Swagger, you want to know another fun fact? You know, you would never get a chopper... You would never be boxed in by Beastly Bunny for getting a chopper gun because you never get one. That is true. Oh, that's true. Uh, Beastly, I have a question for you. When you started this game, um, you spawned on the A side. Have you found that you can pretty much throw a grenade up on that rock and get at least a double kill every time when this game starts out? I don't. I've never really done that. Never really seen that happen. Okay, wait, to, wait, wait. To, you got to get on it. To, yeah, because I noticed you got an assist over there on that rock, but pretty much if you just yeah. walk around that corner and launch a grenade up there, you're going to get somebody every time. They have to always Beastly. go to the rock. Hmm. Beastly, I got a question for hmm. you. Interesting. Now, are you yeah. upset that your team Yeah, that's why you were... Uh, kind of. I mean, I was playing with a few of my friends here, and they really don't really even know how to play Domination. Well, they have done a good job of not encroaching too far into the spawn because everybody's popping up. I mean, this yeah, is yeah. your chopper gunner is doing some work right now. Yeah, I, I, I love I love a good chopper gunner. Good stuff. Especially at the map. I'll miss the chopper gunner in Modern Warfare 3. Well, yeah, the map here, they triple, here they triple capped and they and now everybody's popping up everywhere. But you still seem to be getting them in a favorable position. One quick note about that rock that uh, Swagger was talking about. If you see a guy who persistently goes to that rock, at the end of the game, you can ask him if he's a fan of Lion King or not. <laughs> he gets really confused. Oh, I haven't heard that one. It's just fun, that. fun fact. You could, you could, uh, in the lobby, you know, fun, 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 fun things. Now, Beastly, what two flags do you prefer when you're playing Jungle Domination? Uh, I actually like A and B. Ooh. You know, Beastly, I'd have to, Ooh. I think all three of us would have to disagree with you here. Yeah, you're alone here. You're alone there, kid. Because, with my, uh, you know, professional gaming opinion, because, you know, I'm not a professional gamer or anything, but I have one. I have a professional opinion. I would have to say you get more of an advantage with having C and B. You know? Wouldn't you agree with me, Swagger? I, I would totally agree. You better agree. The only reason that... I would agree also... And I would like to point out that, uh, Beastly, are you a fan of The Lion King? Oh. Yes, I am. <laughs> oh. I could see that. Okay, where were we again? Um, C and B? Yes, yeah. definitely. I, Beastly thinks A and B's, uh, you know, everyone has their own opinion. 
because, you know, they're oh. like assholes, but it doesn't mean <laughs> they're always, it doesn't mean they're always the best option. Uh, Rambo, I'll Rambo, joke, I'll, oh, you are, ahead, I'm going to go ahead and actually support you on this because geographically, if you look at the layout of this map, A is the only logical place that you can really spawn trap. Um, I mean, C, they have three exits, but generally they're going to spawn in that village, and if it's done right, they won't ever be able to get out of there. Yeah, I know. Like, Or when you got A and, or B and C, and you go into the village, they keep spawning way back in, um, down in that, like, you know, area where the water's on the ground and everything, behind yeah. the temple, in that huge open area, they keep spawning down there. If you're, um, over at the village in that area, it's... I think it's much more of an advantage to have B and C, but I guess, you know, what if everybody so got Beastly, their preferences. Yeah, Beastly, I got a question for you. What's your favorite game you've ever played? Uh, it's probably, the only reason why is probably Modern Warfare 2, because it's because of all the quick scoping and stuff that I really enjoyed. Oh, you were really a quick scoper, huh? Yeah. I don't remember you ever quick scoping. I, whenever, whenever Did you really I play quick with scope? You, I, I just not really. I didn't really quick scope. Okay, so we made you actually try to play yeah. the game. Okay, you I see. guys behind you, Beastly. Oh, yeah, I got I you. Uh, I was warning you. You got gotcha. you. Gotta check that radar, bunny. But um. But uh, what about you, Rambo? What's your favorite game? My favorite... Well, what are you talking about? Are we talking multiplayer? Are we talking about story, single-player games? Because there's a different... Uh, overall. Overall. overall gold medal game. champion. Oh, don't ever say that again. But uh, um, I guess I'd have to say my favorite game would be Call of Duty 4. Just because it's the Call of Duty that I bitched the least in. I agree. Swagger, what about you? Um, you know, it's too hard to say. I'm a little bit older than everybody, so I have... Uh, most of the games I started playing were on the original PlayStation, and I was uh, at the time I was into sports games. So for me, you really couldn't beat, like, Madden 2001. I thought it was really good. Um, I unfortunately didn't start playing Call of Duty until probably six months before Black Ops came out and I started on Modern Warfare 2 which was just about the time I got my PS3 so I've been kind of uh, mm -hmm. kind of behind the times <clears throat> in gaming but for me the EA Sports for anything with EA Sports is usually really really good well Scar uh, that's good yeah my uh, personal favorite actually is the Roller Coaster Tycoon series uh -huh. I spent many hours and many days playing that game. I would usually leave it running all night, and then when I got up, I would see how much progress, how much money I made overnight. Mm -hmm. And, uh, yeah, that's probably my favorite. I didn't even say Minecraft. Minecraft's my second favorite game. Roller Coaster, Minecraft, Red Dead Redemption, and then the COD series. Yeah. You, no, can I would have Scar, to... you can tell Scar really likes uh, detail-oriented stuff, because I would fall asleep playing Roller Coaster Tycoon. I, I think, think I would break the disc. <laughs> Yeah. When I first got it, when I first got it, um, it was the first time I ever had anything like that, and I literally never left the computer. And my brother would like do whatever he could to try to get me off the the chair. Like he would ring the doorbell, he would call the phone, trying to get me to leave the computer, and I never would. I would never leave. I would never leave my spot. Is this your second? Is this I was a manager. Gunner? This was actually his third. This is my third. Gunner. Third, three chopper but, gunners in one game. But and, uh, I'm gonna have swagger. I'm gonna have to cut you off here because we're about to run out of time. So if you guys like Beastly's video or the commentary that we did with him, you can uh, give him a like so he can win our weekly competition. Otherwise, you can check out the rest of our videos and see if any of those would, uh, you know, any of those are your favorite. And we'll see you guys later.